You know Alex Williams. Airball Alex Williams? Hmm. You don't know her show? Bro, what? Should I? Yes! She's one of the top national college basketball influencers, and she's blowing up for the Dope Blunt podcast and video channels. You gotta take it seriously. Because them NBA draft hands definitely do. All right, I'll check out. No, no, no. You gonna do it now because she's all over you. Right here, she singled you out and issued a challenge. Throw down. And she even hit me on my socials to make sure you got it. Let me see that. Okay, so I meet this challenge and then what? So I'm sure she'll hype you on the show. Okay, and if I don't? She'll bury you. I seen it happen before, stone cold ruthless. All right, fine. She wants to go, we can go. Mm. I ain't never been afraid of no challenge. Hello and welcome. It's time for college basketball brought to you by 2K Sports. We'll watch the UCLA Bruins in this one as they go up against the Texas Tech Red Raiders. Joined by Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg, I'm Forrest Hunt, and we've got an exciting game on the way here. Jones outside. Back to Bell. Pass to Kelly. Jones. He's guarded by Neely. Carter outside. Now here's Jones. And neatly with the block. Junior right side. And it's the Bruins ball. Kelly with it. Now guarded by Livingston. And here's Bell for three. Good D by Junior. it up and banks it in well, some young players just have that grown man strength junior taking it right to the defender Bell outside from 13 UCLA again missing junior outside now here's Sheldon outside pass to Jones outside Kelly back to Jones Carter now here's Jones Livingston covering just five of the clock count that bucket and I'm not really sure that's the time for the fadeaway but he sure can make it count Here's Junior. Another miss by Junior. And it didn't fall, but that's the kind of shot they want their offense to create. And that has him shaking his head. Tough miss. Now here's Carter. Outside Kelly. Over Livingston. Kelly, no good. Junior up top. He's covered by Bell. And Junior gets it to go. And the timing Junior has on the pull-up. Luck watching him stick it to the deep. Carter outside. Bell covered by Junior. Pass to Carter. Bell puts up a three. Thompson grabs the board. Junior outside. Hits the three-point bomb. You know, you have to stretch the floor for the offense to flow smoothly, and Junior understands that, and he's doing his part. Outside Kelly. Jones. He's guarded by Neely. Jones' shot's off. Texas Tech leading. Inside. Here's Livingston. A beautiful reverse layup. Adding to their advantage, trying to find a way to blow this one open. I tell you, there's no substitute for consistency, Greg. You know that, I know it. Uh, you can stay in control of the game. They'll stay in control of it if they simply stay good with their execution of the game plan and don't waste any possession. 
Watch out now. When this guy gets into a rhythm, it is something to behold. So it's UCLA now. They trail by seven. Carter outside. Jones over Neely. Jones' is shots off. Boy, you've really got to put those away, especially against soft interior defense. Here's Junior, and a foul on the shot. He'll go to the strike for two. You know, what I like most about Junior is how he stays confident, composed, and focused. I mean, even when he's going through a tough stretch, for a young player that's just developing, he's got a lot of self-confidence. A big group substitution here for UCLA. Here's McGee. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Back to Adams. Coven. Adams with the screen. Shot from free throw range. Here's Sheldon. The basket is good. Starting off one for one with that shot. Really nice job to convert the putback opportunity there. I mean, he stayed with that play from start to finish. That's something we say about him a lot. And Junior gets it to go. Guys, his consistency in terms of shooting has really helped them seize control. Pass to Sheldon. McGee covered by Junior. Here's Sheldon. the Bruins with another bucket. Now Junior. 11 points in the game. Sheldon with a block. Outside McGee. And stolen by Junior. Here's the break. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. Tremendous effort getting the steal, then getting the ball up the court. Exactly. The defense really no chance to get back. Here's Martin. Pass to McGee. The three. And it's Mills with the rebound. Junior with it. And McGee picks him up defensively. And here's Denman. Back to Junior. Shoots the three. Nope. He's now missed more than he's made. Four for nine. UCLA trailing. Outside McGee. Pass to Sheldon. With the fadeaway. Rebound Texas Tech. And guys, you've heard of overpassing. Well, that shot was an example of underpassing. Yeah, he checked or not. I don't care how hot he may or may not be. He's not making that one. Now here's McGee. He's tightly guarded. Again, the miss by the Bruins. A good board there, but overall they're getting slightly out-rebounded. And that's a good place to start if you're going to try to find your way back into this game. Get to work on the glass. Sheldon pass to Pavin. Back to Sheldon. And here's McGee. Covered by Junior. Fires for three. And Nixon pulls it down. Here's Junior. Banked it off the glass. You know, of the last six baskets, five have come on the interior. This is major smash mouth basketball, guys. It's all about imposing your will offensively, getting exactly the kind of looks their coach grew up. Back to Carter. Pass to Kelly. Now here's Jones. Kelly with it. There's the screen. Back to Jones. To stop the drought. That one a little long. Junior right side. That shot missing. And UCLA goes the other way with it. Now Kelly. The tray. 
That's it, and he's found his range with that one. Now one for two. Look at Bell's unselfishness, and I tell you, that would easily translate to the next level. He takes a lot of pride in setting up his teammate. Shot from the wing. Thompson can't get it to go. They can shave the deficit to single digits right here. Carter outside. Adams, he's guarded by Neely. Back to Adams. And with that one, the lead is trimmed to single digits. Seems to have a knack for hitting guys in their spots. His vision, excellent. Thompson with the ball. Kicks it out to Junior. In for his seventh make in 14 attempts. Hey, I think the catch and shoot is all about shot preparation and decisiveness. And Junior, no hesitation there. Carter outside. Adams over Neely. Adams, no good. You know, the right thing there to try to fade away with the D all over him, but that is a difficult shot to see. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact, and he'll shoot two. On the drive, Junior's athleticism puts the defense off balance. They get sloppy, and he nabs a foul while getting the shot off. And good on the second, so he makes both. And here's Bell. No scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Pass to Adams. Bell with it. Back to Adams. Carter. Back to Adams. The fadeaway. Rebounded by Montgomery. Junior left side. Uses the glass to finish the layup. And with the game he's having, I think Junior must have gotten some extra motivation. This has become a statement game for him. And here's Bell from the arc. And the release was before the buzzer, but it's off target. So we conclude the first half. Red Raiders out in front, leading by 14. And through the first half of play, what about Junior's performance stands out? He's in a tremendous rhythm offensively. The defense trying everything they can to slow him down to no avail. Hey, and he's confident to begin with now. When he gets on a roll like this, best of luck to you. Bring help and plenty of it. Make somebody else beat you is the strategy. Junior left side. And here's UCLA. It's a 14-point game. Pass to Jones. Now Bell. Back to Jones. Carter with the ball. Here's the pick. Here's Sheldon. And a missed layup. Now here's Junior. He's got 21. And two free throws coming up as he misses that one, drawing the whistle on a lot of contact there. It goes on Bell. You have to display disciplined defense against Junior. You don't want to bail out guys with his kind of skill set. Both good from the line that time. Here's Bell. He hasn't yet put up any points in this one. Carter outside. Pass to Jones. Bell called that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. That one misses. And the second free throw was good. They're trying to add a few more points to their lead. And they should just stay with what they've been doing. Pass to Junior. There's the triple. Drills the three-pointer. You know, Thompson is really an effective combo guard. But in addition to his scoring ability, his passing skills are impressive, too. 
Jones. He's guarded by Neely. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up. Two shots coming up. That one on Neely. Both shots good from the stripe. Now Junior. He's got 26. To the paint. Shelton with a steal. Here's Bell. Up top, Kelly. Out to the wing. Down low, Jones. Beautiful dish, and the layup goes in. Nice job hitting him right in stride. Excellent play. Now here's Junior. He's covered by Bell. Here's Thompson. Two points. That one goes in. A nice shot against tough defense. Thompson actually gets hit on the way up, but able to maintain that concentration. Outside Kelly. Pass to Jones. Over Detman. Jones is shots off. Well, they've only got a slight edge in rebounding when you look at the numbers, but it certainly feels a lot bigger than it is. <laughs> yeah, the score has a lot to do with that. Their overall effort and execution has been elite. Always a good idea to go up strong inside. Junior draws contact and gets to the line. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. So it's UCLA now. They trail by 18. McGee on the wing. Oh, anticipated the pass. Turnover. And the dunk by Junior. Boy, that's exactly what his coaches want from him. They want Junior attacking the rim and playing with energy at that end of the floor. Bell outside. Martin. Bell. He's covered by Bell. And they're moving it up. Here's Nixon. And down it goes for two points. Boy, you have to be impressed with the offensive production. They have got it firing on all cylinders. And, you know, the lead just keeps growing. I mean, this game is not going to get out of their grip. They're going to keep pulling away. Jones' is shots off. Clearly out of rhythm now, guys. I mean, just one for five to begin the second half. And the foul called on Junior. It's the Bruins ball. Poked loose. Junior with it. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Well, it's obvious that Junior is a tough kid. I mean, he sticks with the play even through the contact there. The floater. Good on the shot. And here's Junior. Now here's Livingston. Junior outside. And the layup falls. Some defensive breakdowns are starting to show up now. Their last four buckets allowed have come from very close range. Yeah, high percentage shots are what they are getting in terms of the attempts, and that's just not going to get it done. They've got to figure it out. Here's McGee from outside off the mark. With the success they've had rebounding the basketball, they're right where you'd expect them to be. 
firmly in control of this game. And, and no doubt about it, rebounding is an effort stat, folks. They've been more determined than their opponent thus far. Carter outside. Pass to Adams. Shoots the fader. And that's off the glass and in. Heads up play there, guys, on the assist and the finish. Junior drives in. Can't cash in from close range. Here's McGee. Adams, back to McGee. Outside Kelly, now Carter. Pass to McGee. And here's Carter. Adams. Can't hit the turnaround jumper. Tough miss, especially since the defense wasn't that strong. I mean, he needs to cash in from there. Junior drives in. Yep, that one goes. Well, I tell you what, I need to see some more assertiveness out of these defenders. They're not getting the job done. That's a great point. Ten of the last 12 points they've allowed have come at the rim. Carter's shot's off. And if you ask me what percentage of the time he's making that shot, my answer would be in the single digits. Well, you can't be forcing a shot like that. You got to keep the ball moving. Get something better. Carter, outside. Kelly. Pass to Adams. Carter with the ball. Covered by Junior. McGee with the ball. Three-pointer. It's rebounded by Livingston. Well, he wants to shoot his way out of this cold spell, but the struggles continue. Yeah, big time. I mean, the words that come to mind, ice and cold and disappearing stroke, all with a plot. Now Rodgers. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need a basket. Stanley outside. Over Junior. And it's Stanley missing. One item that stood out, their ball movement. Things are definitely clicking. And more importantly, it makes it really hard to defend. UCLA with the ball. Pass the buckets. Here's Pavin. Now Rogers. He's covered by Holland. UCLA again missing. They are enjoying a commanding lead. And it really gives them the opportunity to give their starters a rest. Always critical when you get ready for that home stretch. Here's Barry. Here's Holland. Junior outside for three. Connects from three-point range. Well, this is what you're trying to do. Put the game away. From where I sit, Greg, it's a simple deduction. If they want things to be easy on themselves here late, make sure he has the ball. Stanley, covered by Junior. Pass to Buckets. It's going to be out of bounds. The Bruins will retain possession. So no problem for Texas Tech as they get the win. And without question, Junior was the driving force. He set the tone with his energy and effort, and his teammates followed en route to a blowout victory. And guys, I think we all caught a glimpse of just how special this young man can be. Games like this one will certainly catch the attention of NBA scouts. And that concludes our broadcast. Yes, this is a good thing. We got the W, you did your thing. Alex Williams is gonna be hyping you up for sure. 
I'm just glad we got the win. It's one step closer to the tourney. And Alex Williams. Both can be true, Junior. I'm not saying it's a bad thing, but I'm about the team. That's my mentality, always has been, always will be. Alex Williams or no Alex Yeah, Williams. and I hear that, but look, at this level and the next level, the media is going to overanalyze every move we make on and off the court, and it's affecting the team because they're hearing it and they're reading it. Mm -hmm. If Alex Williams is burying you, then we all dealing with it. But look, your draft stock go rise. You'll see. I ain't mad at that. As long as we keep winning, everything else will take care of itself. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. That was funny. <laughs> What's up, Junior? Good to see you. You too, Arch. <laughs> I gotta walk. So look, I'll, I'll get right to the point. I know what happened between Coach Bishop and I is still eating at you. Yeah, it didn't sit right. Look, I want everything to work out between us, but Coach Bishop don't trust you, and he just wants what's best for me. Hey, 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 so do I. Yeah. But you still want to get paid if I make it to the NBA, which is fair. You know, I got you here. You did? When you had your choice of schools, I never tried to nudge you either way. That's right. I was surviving before we met, Junior, and I'd still be surviving if you decided to never play basketball. Look, Art, you got me here. And I love this place and what I'm trying to accomplish for this school, but things can change if I don't feel like they're working out. I just want that to be clear. Okay. We don't have a contract. That's clear. All I can do is keep trying to earn your trust. Okay. So, you ready to see what the inside word on your draft stock is? <laughs> Definitely. All right, so look, I, I gathered all my intel into one place for you to take a look at, but it can update as the season goes. So, what's this all supposed to mean right now? <laughs> Nothing yet, but it'll all shape up as we get closer to the end of the season. Just keep winning, keep your numbers up, and your stock will rise. Okay, and if we're losing and I'm not producing, then it'll fall. I mean, I, I was gonna say it's not that simple, but it kinda is. <laughs> all right. Work to do. Catch you later, Arch. Bad boy. Can I help you? You're junior, right? Yeah, that's right. I'm Alex Williams. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Um, how'd you get on the bus? How did I get on the bus? Yeah. You'd be surprised by how many people think press pass means all access. Uh. Can I say what a pleasure it is to meet Mr. Big Time Professor Dunk himself? I'm just wondering whether I should call you a selfish layer, a chemistry risk, or, you know, tell the truth and let everyone know you did it for a girl. Who told you that? I never reveal my sources. But his name rhymes with Ted. Uh, listen, um, these other players that you're covering, mm -hmm. Now, they don't get the same, let's just call it attention. Attention. Yeah, attention. Yeah. So what's the deal with it? What's the deal? Well, I get it. It may seem cruel or, you know, arbitrary, but it's the opposite. I, I love the potential of who you are and what your game is all about. At times, it can be inspiring. Okay, and at other times? At other times, not so much, but you're growing and developing, and this is my way of helping you reach your potential. <laughs> so why can't you just say that in an article? What's with all these games? Because I'm building a profile, too. And games, conflict, that gets eyeballs and clicks. And what if you don't develop? I write a cuddly piece about you, and then what? NBA decision makers pay attention to what I say. I've built a career on honest, unmerciful critiques, and I'm not backing down from that now. Look, the stakes are impossible at this level, Junior. You know that. And even worse when you get to the next level. 
you might as well prepare for it now. Everyone knew your dad was up for it. It's a long shadow that follows you around. Is that funny? It is, because it's an angle. My, trust me, I get where you're coming from. But the media is a lot more twisted about the legacy of Duke than I am. Am I supposed to take that at face value? I'm assuming you got another challenge for me. <laughs> yeah, I do. Two games. First and foremost, I'm all about winners, so win the games. Secondly, everyone wants to see you develop as a scorer. So bump your scoring average up from where it is now. What do you say? Challenge accepted. Challenge accepted. Nice. There's something about you. Professor Dunk. It's the big time. Welcome everybody to College Basketball presented by 2K Sports. This should be a fun one. In this game, we'll see the Michigan State Spartans against the Texas Tech Red Raiders. Joined today by Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg, I'm Forrest Hunt and College Hoops action is just around the corner here. Pass to McLeod. Back to Mills. Over to the wing. Here's Lambert. And the ball out of play. The Red Raiders will have it. On offense, here are the Red Raiders. Here's Junior. It's good, and he makes his first shot of the game. You know, when he's effective on the inside, Junior can give opponents a lot of problems. It also spreads the defense and opens up the perimeter for him. Outside, Lambert. To the left wing. Outside, Hayward. Tries again, and he lays it in. Talk about a fearless approach and mindset. Hayward is not the tallest guy on the court. But that doesn't mean he'll shy away from the interior. Here's Junior. He can't get that one. And Michigan State the other way now. Now here's Hayward. Covered by Junior. Back to Hayward. Down low. McLeod misses. Junior with it. Now guarded by Harvey. Here's Junior. It's good. Really hard to deny Junior. He plays with so much passion on that end of the floor. Now the Spartans with it. Outside, Hayward. To the wing, right side. Pass to Mills. And here's Hayward. Jacks up the three. And the Spartans, another three. And no matter who it is, that kind of D isn't going to get it done. Junior with it. And here's Red Thompson from the arc. And again, it's the Red Raiders from deep. And we knew what Thompson was thinking here. It's no secret he's out to distinguish himself as a top college prospect from beyond the arc. Now, here's Lambert. Back to Hayward. Cloud. Lambert up top. Up again. It's good on the putback. You know we talk about it all the time, guys. Those second chance buckets, always the result of that extra effort. Junior left side. And foul called as he misses and will shoot two free throws. Well, you can see Junior's grit right there. His willingness to get physical, meet the contact, and draw fouls, that bodes well for his future and actually bodes well for the present, too. And that's good as he hits both shots. Michigan State trailing. 
Now here's Webb. There's a screen. Here's O'Connor to the middle. Weber, Bush, rebounded by Montgomery. And here's Junior. Six points for him. And that one drops for him. And early on, they've been nearly perfect from the floor. Just the one miss here on their first five attempts. Screen by Webb. Pass to McLeod from deep. Here's O'Connor. And that's good. A nice job on the glass. And they pick up two on the second effort. How about the perseverance there? The extra effort on that offensive glass. Junior high post. King on Webb. Junior no good. Now Webb. To the right side. to McLeod foul called that time on the way up that'll give him two chances at the free throw line here so he picks up just one from the line that time Texas Tech leading Dipped. stolen by Webb here's the break The three. Texas Tech with the rebound. Junior left side. Got a piece of it. And they'll keep possession. And they're able to recover. Count that bucket. Beautiful reverse. He got his glide on and left the D in the rear view mirror. Webb with it. They set a pick. Pass to Weber. And he was fouled on the way up. Two free throws coming for him. Detman picks one up. And the free throw, no good. So both teams changing it up here. And he misses the second one as well. So 0 for 2 that time. Junior with it. Webb picks him up. And it's Junior missing. Pass to Hayward. Here's Weber. Outside Lambert. Webb. A good looking shot in the wing. Here's Texas Tech now. Outside Mills. Pass to Junior. This time for three. And again, it's Texas Tech with a three. When he makes a catch and fire, Junior shows the confidence he's gaining in that shot. Outside Lambert. Harvey to the inside. Here's Weber. That one wide left. Well, despite that possession, something that I've liked is they've been under control while getting out in this lead. They've kept those turnovers down. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Outside Kelly. Back to Hayward. Over Thompson. It's rebounded by Holland. Now here's Junior. He's guarded by Hayward. Here's Junior. Let's it go from 11. No good there. Good work defensively by Hayward. Now here's Mills. From D. Neely pulls it in. Junior drives in. 
his shots just it's not there right now with his team leading perhaps you know let's focus on some other areas of the game unloads from 13 feet the second chance effort and two shots coming up here at the line as he gets fouled on the shot and that's going to be a foul on Texas Tech and the Red Raiders making a change here that one falls so he hits both of them and so it's Texas Tech with it here's Thompson and here's Hayward outside Kelly right side Mills Lambert He's guarded by Neely. Outside, Mills. Inside, Harvey. The score now all even. Nice job creating for the easy deuce. On the wing, Junior. to the scoring column, his fifth of the game. Great to see Junior stretch the floor. That, that kind of work will do wonders for his team's spacing. Hayward, covered by Junior. Pass to Kelly. Mills. Now here's Kelly. Harvey with it. Right block shot. Another one falls for Michigan State. Really crisp, intelligent passing to make that basket possible. Now Thompson. The floater. Chuck up two there. Hey, for any player, but particularly a combo guard like Thompson at 6'4", you need the teardrop in your bag. It's a must-have. Hayward with it. Junior's there. That's miss number three for him. Now two for five from the floor. On offense, here are the Red Raiders. Three-point lead. Good for his sixth make out of a dozen attempts, shooting 50%. Some young players just have that grown man strength. Junior taking it right to the defender. There's a four-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Back to Lambert. Pass to Mills. Hayward. Over Junior. Hayward's shot is off. Junior outside. No good with the layup. And the first half comes to an end. We've got a close game going on here. It's the Red Raiders up by five. And through the first half of play, what about Junior's performance stands out? He's in a tremendous rhythm offensively. The defense trying everything they can to slow him down to no avail. Hey, and he's confident to begin with now. When he gets on a roll like this, best of luck to you. Bring help and plenty of it. Make somebody else beat you is the strategy. From deep three-point range. No good that time. And it's Michigan State the other way. Outside, Mills. Loud. The three ball. Doesn't get it to drop for him. Junior outside. Neely. Lambert defending. Back to Junior. Michigan State grabs the miss. Now Hayward. He has five. Pass to McLeod. Back to Hayward. Rebounded by Montgomery. Texas Tech leading. Here's Junior outside. That shot off the mark. Now here's Hayward, covered by Junior. Right wing. 
Fades back. And that one goes long. I wouldn't say that's exactly his spot now. I mean, and you can see why. Thompson with the ball. He's got five. Here's Neely. It's rebounded by Lambert. Now here's Hayward. Covered by Junior. Pass to McLeod. Back to Hayward. Shoots the three. That one is off. And the shots just continue to say no in terms of falling. Here's Junior. And the basket is good. And finally, someone scores. <laughs> yeah, it's been a defensive battle to say the least, partner. Good to see at least somebody got the ball in the basket. Finally. Here's Mills. He's covered by Holland. Baseline try. And it's Mills missing. Now here's Thompson. Junior outside. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two here. Always a good idea to go up strong inside. Junior draws contact and gets to the line. And he makes them both. Here's Webb. They're looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. Timeout called. The Spartans. Junior really making a difference here. They don't seem to have any answers for him. They need to review their game plan and look for a way to cool him off. to the paint. Here's Webb. And he floats it in for an easy two. Credit the assist on that play. And the D has to push Webb out of that comfort zone. No reason to give him those kind of opportunities. Junior drives in. And the dunk by Junior. Michigan State trailing. Outside Webb. Texas Tech with the rebound. And here's Junior. He's got 22. And the dunk by Junior. And with the game he's having, I think Junior must have gotten some extra motivation. This has become a statement game for him. Out on the right wing. Back to Webb. There's the screen. Fires for three. Second chance shot. No good on the layup. Junior left side. And so he draws the foul on the shot. A trip to the line to shoot two. It's going to be on Webb. On the drive, Junior's athleticism puts the defense off balance. They get sloppy and he nabs a foul while getting the shot off. And the Spartans with possession here. It's a 13-point game. Pass to Weber. Bush. Here's Webb. Laid in with a nice touch off the glass. That's a textbook example of how to move the ball. Boy, you got to love that action. The drive by Junior. The shot misses. And Michigan State the other way now. Here's O'Connor. Second shot opportunity, and he lays it up and in. And the D getting out work there on the putback. Can't let that happen. You know, that just can't happen. They need much more effort than that on the glass. Pass to Junior. The three. And the three ball is good. Watch out. Now that he's got his first three of the half, there may be more in store. Outside, Webb. Here's Weber. Back to Webb. Weber covered by Dentman. Webb for three. It's hauled in by Dentman. And it's the Red Raiders ball. Junior drives in. And the dunk by Junior. 
And once Junior spots a lane, it's all over. Flies inside and goes right over the defense for a big dunk. Outside Webb. For three. Bangs home the trifecta. Boy, he's doing everything he can at this point. The rest of his teammates need to step up and give him some help. So both teams making some changes here. And so it's Texas Tech with it. They lead by 11. They set the screen. Here's Holland. Texas Tech again missing. Now Lambert. Pass to Mills. Over Holland. And it's Mills missing. And that's really just not heads up basketball. Don't try a fade away when nobody's guarding you. Junior with it, and it's Mills picking him up. A nice shot by Junior. You want plays at the basket? You want threes? Junior's willing to take what the defense gives him, and that's the sign of a maturing player. Pass to Lambert. Over Detman. Lambert, no good. Now here's Junior. He's guarded by Hayward. Here's Holland. Here's Junior outside. And it's Mills with the rebound. And the Spartans with possession here. Trailing by 13. Great pass to set up the land. In that tight, with that much of an advantage height-wise, there's just not a lot the defense can do. He lets go from deep. Here's Detman. And Lambert with the block. Outside, Mills. Pass to Lambert. Off the mark. Had a chance there to trim it to single digits. Junior from deep. And out of bounds, the Spartans will take it. Now the Spartans with it. 11-point game. Picked by Lambert. Outside, Mills. Back to Hayward. Unable to get that one to go. Some solid defense from Neely. Thompson with the ball. it to go and a smart basketball player Thompson doesn't neglect the mid-range and he'll take what the defense gives him pass to Lambert Hayward here's Mills Hayward covered by Junior here's McLeod here's Lambert Another shot. And that's two points on the layup. Really nice job to convert the putback opportunity there. I mean, he stayed with that play from start to finish. That's something we say about him a lot. And that one is good. And what confidence from Thompson. His coach is encouraging him to shoot it off the dribble when given the chance. Now here's Hayward, covered by Junior. Pass to McLeod. Rebound Texas Tech. A good chance for them to slow it down. Yeah, they definitely should use some clock here. Here's Thompson. The teardrop, and the layup is up and in. Once they smelled blood in the water, you could see the killer instinct take over. Yeah, not taking any chances, Greg. 
This is how you close a game out. Textbook. Now here's Hayward. Outside, Mills. Pass to Harvey. Down low. Here's McLeod. Some solid defense from Red Thompson. Now here's Junior. He's closely guarded. So no problem for Texas Tech as they get the win. A double-digit margin and no question that Junior had his fingerprints all over this victory. Quite the show. Continuing to live up to the ever-growing hype. He looked extremely focused throughout and, as you said, made his mark. And for Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg, I'm Forrest Hunt. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.